5 Ways to Reduce Oil on the Face Correctly Reducing oil on the face cannot be done haphazardly. If done excessively or in an inappropriate way, facial skin can become dry and irritated. To find out how to reduce oil on your face properly and effectively, see the following explanation. Natural facial oil or sebum is actually good for keeping the skin moist and preventing wrinkles. However, excess oil can clog pores and cause blackheads and acne. Increased oil production on the surface of the skin can be triggered by several factors, such as heredity, hormonal disorders, increasing age, frequent sweating, or excessive stress. Getting to know combination skin and oily skin. Before knowing the type of treatment that suits your skin, you need to get to know the characteristics of oily skin and combination skin, which often experience complaints of excess oil on your face. Combination skin owners usually have more oil in the forehead, nose and chin area, T area, while the cheek area doesn't have too much oil. Pores will appear larger, shiny, and have blackheads. Combination skin requires different care for each of these areas, for example moisturizer that is only applied to the cheek area. Meanwhile, owners of oily skin have large pores, thicker, shiny skin look dull and blotchy, and are prone to developing blackheads and pimples. In contrast to combination skin types, owners of oily skin will feel all parts of their face as greasy and slippery. Essential Basic Care for Reducing Oil on the Face There are several ways you can do to reduce excess oil on your face, namely. 1. Wash your face twice a day. You are advised to wash your face twice a day, namely in the morning and at night, or when your facial skin is sweating a lot. Also make it a habit to wash your face and the rest of your makeup before going to bed. When washing your face, use a gentle facial cleanser and avoid rubbing it too hard to prevent irritation to your facial skin. 2. Choose facial skin care products carefully. When using facial care and makeup products, Choose those that are water-based and do not contain oil or alcohol. Usually these products are labeled oil-free or non-comedogenic. Apart from that, you can also use facial skin care products that contain tretinoin, glycolic acid or salicylic acid. Products containing these ingredients are useful for removing excess oil, shrinking pores, and helping to treat acne. However, be careful with tretinoin-based products because they are not safe for use by pregnant women or women who are planning to become pregnant. 3. Use moisturizer regularly. Some people think that people with oily skin don't need to use moisturizer. In fact, this assumption is not true. Oily skin owners still need moisturizer, but only for oily areas and don't need to use it every day. Also, choose an oil-free moisturizer to prevent clogged pores. 4. Use sunscreen. When doing outdoor activities, always use an oil-free sunscreen that has an SPF of at least 30 and is fortified with zinc oxide and titanium dioxide. Sunscreen will protect your skin from sun exposure which can cause wrinkles, age spots, and even skin cancer. To maximize skin protection, you can also wear a hat or sunglasses. 5. Pasting oil paper. When facial skin feels very oily, try using oil paper. The way to use oil paper is to stick the paper on the oily area for a few seconds, then remove it. Don't rub oil paper against your skin, as this will spread the oil to other areas of your face. Oily skin is prone to acne. 
However, when this skin problem appears, you should not touch or squeeze pimples because it can make pimples more inflamed and infected. In addition, squeezed pimples can also cause acne scars that are difficult to get rid of. Apart from the methods above, you also need to balance oily facial skin care with a healthy lifestyle. If oily skin is still difficult to overcome, consult a dermatologist for further treatment.